Hi, my friends. Welcome back to my channel. And I have a very special unboxing for you today. This is Allison and um, I have placed my second order of pinch me dough and it has come and I promise you all I have done so far is I have slit the tape off this box. So we're going to all be seeing everything in my therapy dough haul, uh, pinch me haul, uh, being unboxed today. So let's check it out. Okay. Um, you guys may remember from my last pinch me video, uh, I discovered this product on Shark Tank and look now this is coming with a little, um, like a informational card here as seen on Shark Tank. So this is, if you didn't know, pinch me was, um, on the show Shark Tank and this is how I found out about it. So this is showing some of the various scents that they have and a little bit of information about this product. So that is really cool. I'm gonna put that to the side. And we have some bubble wrap. Take that away. Oh my goodness, yay! This is so exciting. So here's some information once again. Um, if you did not catch my my video the last time just to let you know. Oh, there's a couple of them. This is really nice that she included more than one because sometimes I give these as gifts and I want somebody to know a little information about the product. So this is super, super nice. Um, so a couple things about Pinch Me Dough if you did not see the last vid. Um, it is going to be a stress reduction tool and you can use it almost like a, like a, a stress ball you can squeeze it and kind of poke it and pinch it and all these things. Um, not only does it have just that kind of stress relieving quality for squeezing, it smells wonderful. So there's aromatherapy properties in this product and, um, you know, it's portable. There's a small little jar you can carry with you. And I think my favorite thing about this product is when you make a purchase from pinch me, they are, um, supporting the Wounded Warrior Project, which is amazing. So um, that's just some information. And thank you so much, Nancy, for, for the extra cards. I love that. So what I was wanting to do with my purchases today is I wanted to show you the variety of the products they have. So I'm, I'm gonna have products in more than one size and some of the different products that they offer. So um, I ordered three things. And I did let Nancy know she wanted to thank me for my last video and she sent an, along a surprise. Actually, I think she might have sent us two surprises. So there's three things I ordered and I think some surprises in here now that I'm just surveying the box. Um, so let's get started. One of the things I wanted you to see was the sizes of the aromatherapy dough that is offered. So, oh gosh, you know what? I'm going to unbubble wrap each and every one of these things off camera and I'm going to get back with you. So I just want you to see these are all beautifully wrapped, but it's with tape and I got my nails on. So I am going to unwrap these and I'll be right back. And we're back. Okay. So what are we going to look at first? I'm so excited. Um, I think we're gonna look at the grapefruit. So what I'm gonna do is just gonna kind of move these guys aside and let's focus in on the grapefruit. It's like a very pale peach color, cute label. And let's take a look. Oh my gosh, this is like, I feel like the most charming thing. When you open up that jar and you see that impression pinch me, it is so cool. Um, so let's take a look. Oh, this is not like an overwhelming scent. Oh, it's so smooth. This texture is amazing. Today's a very hot day and I, well, I didn't just get the mail. It's been inside for a little bit. So hopefully, oh my gosh. As I'm touching this, the scent is getting released. So I want you to know when you first open that jar for that very first time, you might think that the scent is not very strong. But um, in actuality, as I am starting to manip manipulate this dough, I am smelling a wonderful 
I have to sniff it too close to my nose. I'm smelling it. Oh, it smells really good. I'm like a fresh cut grapefruit. I'm like if you cut one in half and you get that nice, oh, this is such a gratifying texture too, soft. Um, so this is grapefruit, very, again, like a almost like peach color, off white in a peach direction, very nice looking color. And it has that grapefruit, very realistic, I would say, grapefruit scent. I'm sniffing it again. So this is my lovely little jar. Let's see something. Let me see if I can pull the rest out. I feel like there is possibly got a little affected by the humidity today. We have about 90 degrees in New York today. Um, so just like my other sense of pinch me, it's just smooth as ever, really smooth to the touch. I like to like pull it apart in little pieces. Let's, let me show you some on the, let's see if you can get some of the texture here. I'm getting it. It's very like Play-Doh for grown-ups, you know, smooth, gratifying roll it up in a log or you can you know make shapes with it i sometimes roll it up into a ball and just kind of go like that but this is a nice smell it doesn't smell artificial like an artificial grapefruit scent like if there was candy that was grapefruit you know it's always kind of like an off scent that doesn't smell like the real fruit this smells like the real deal so i think this is gonna be a really nice energizing scent for people. I think cer certain citrus smells are just sort of energizing because kind of that scent to it that's bright, kind of a happy scent. So I love this, this uh, fragrance. The dough texture is wonderful, as I know from my other pinch me um, scents that I've ordered in the past. So here's our grapefruit. When I want to put it back in the jar, I find I, I usually make a ball like this and then I put it in my jar. Sometimes I have to kind of get the air out to get the jar um, lid to close so it's not too full. But that is grapefruit and I love the scent. I love the scent. I feel calmer already. I've just kind of played with this for a few minutes. so. Let's try the next one, shall we? All right, so here's what I wanna do with you guys. Um, this was my kind of purpose in making this video is to sort of show you the variety. Um, so this big mama is ocean. This is ocean and this is the 10 ounce size, just as a comparison, we just looked at um, grapefruit, which is the three ounce size. And this is significantly larger. Look how big that is. Okay, so I'm gonna open this up and let's get a peek of the inside. Oh my gosh, there is that signature pinch me stamp. It is just like, puts me in a good mood to see that. And I don't even have to touch it to start to smell. Oh, this is like, This is like, really does recall the ocean. I, I feel like it's like the salt of the sea, like a very fresh, clean water-like scent. And I know that's, what is water-like scent? Uh, Beach-like uh, ocean water. Um, I hate the part where I have to mess up the stamp, but we're going to mess the stamp up because we're together and we're going to check out what is it like to have like this huge dough. I have no, uh, jumbo <laughs> sized dough before. So we're about to find out what this is like. Um, I'm going to try to pull the whole thing out for you. Let's do it. We are together. This is, we're investigating. Oh my gosh. This is fun. This is fun. Look how big this jar is. So when we're talking about 
10 ounces of dough. This is really a beautiful color, absolutely gorgeous. Let me push these out of the way so you get like the full experience. But oh my gosh, this is, it's really unique to play with this much. Um, I feel like this is even more than like what a can of Play-Doh has. Like this is a huge, look at my hand. It's like filling up my hand. Um, I could really get the straight. If you're really stressed, you might want to have a big one. Like if you really want to kind of punch out the um, stressful vibes, this is definitely kind of a fun feeling to have that full handful of dough. Um, me, I don't know. I don't know if I would get the big one again because one thing that I find myself doing, maybe I'll show you on one of the next small ones, is um, I just open the jar and I sniff it to get the aromatherapy benefits when I'm working, like when I'm in a Zoom meeting or I'm listening to a call. Um, sometimes I just give it a little inhale and just enjoy. This is really a peaceful scent. I wanna say, um, Nothing feminine or masculine. Like, I think everybody would like both of these scents, grapefruit and ocean. This is really um, not a, you know, it's not like a florally scent or anything like that. But um, I love just sniffing them. And sometimes one thing I do is when I have the little jar, I, I just kind of open it and I poke my finger and I don't even take the dough out of the jar. Um, this is when you really want to kind of squeeze, massage, manipulate. I, I love the feeling of having so much in my hand here. Uh, but I'm probably somebody that needs only the small one, but I think it's super fun to see the size differential. This is a very generous amount of dough we're being given in this 10 ounce size. This is really much bigger than I thought. Um, my face is about a foot from this dough and I'm just getting a beautiful aroma kind of filtering towards my face. And um, I, have that calm peaceful feeling I could close my eyes and be at the ocean honestly it is a very beachy scent but I would say there's nothing about this if you're not somebody that likes that sunscreen kind of I, there I don't smell any of that sunscreeny smell you know how sometimes you get a candle that says beach and it smells like just suntan lotion <laughs> it's not that it's not that it's like a salt sea salt air I would describe it mostly as an absolutely refreshing, peaceful scent. Whereas I think that the grapefruit gave me a little energizing um, experience. I think that this one is giving me a calm, a very calm feeling. So I'm gonna kinda ball this up. Let's see if we can make a ball that's gonna fit back in the jar. And then we're gonna try the next one, okay? So let's see. There we go. guys let's check out the next product and this is going to be the pairing this is the pairing of um, a three ounce therapy dough with a three ounce therapy spritz um, and what we are we receive also just so you know we are also receiving instructions for both um, so the mist me product here is um, supposed to be another stress reduction tool, again, using aromatherapy to relax us at the first sign of stress. Um, so according to this directions, we are going to um, hold the spritz at an arm's length to sp spritz across your face and body. And in an instant, we'll feel relaxed, refreshed, and rejuvenated. So I'm super excited for this. But before I spritz, I'm going to open the dough. Um, so let's put this off to the side for a second. And let's just take a look. We know about... This is again... I don't know. I never... It doesn't get old, does it? Just to see the little stamp. It's very cute. Um, so this is the Pinch Me flavor, flavor scent called Relief. And this is a pink, light pink color. It's a really pretty color, pale pink. Um, oh, it's got a nice smell. I am going. All right, so I am getting in there 
and um, I love the color, first of all. Absolutely love this pink. And oh my gosh, I'm already getting this scent. As I start to pull this out, I always get like a little whiff of the dough, even if I don't stick my nose up close to it. It's like, you know, a really nice scent comes towards me. So I am pulling this all out. What is, how am I gonna describe this scent? It is almost like a powdery, floral, scent. It is almost in line with a bubblegum like flavor, but it is not as sweet, not at all cloying, not a cloying sweet smell. I would call it sweet, but not a very faint sweetness that is, you know, sometimes when you're, you ever get that feeling when you smell a really sweet smell and it's like, nauseating this is not this is like very mild um you know sometimes too strong a scent can be overwhelming I always have a hard time in the department store area where there's all those fragrances this is like definitely in the line of fruity I want to say there's almost like a tutti fruity kind of scent um powdery I would say of the scents that I have smelled from Pinch Me. This one may be the closest to what I would call a feminine smell. Um, Cause it does have sort of like that fruity kind of powdery scent. Not like a baby powder exactly. I, I don't know. I'm having trouble describing this one. I, I like it though. Relief. Like a fruity flavor. I brought you down a little closer so you can see. Um, let's take a look. Let's able here. You can see that smooth texture that I just cannot get enough of. It's so soft. It's fun to play with. You can knead it like dough, but it's not a lot of resistance. You know, it's like if you were somebody who might have trouble with your hands sometimes, like maybe somebody with arthritis or other um joint problems it's not i don't think this would be hard for you to do my dad had a, a physical therapy gel that was i couldn't even hardly make a dent in it i think the purpose was it was so firm that your hand was supposed to be getting exercise as you manipulated it this is not going to do that to you if you were wondering this is super soft i'm not having any difficulty here you know it's really just a soft and calming experience not going to stress you out because you can't um handle this this texture <laughs> so um really like this scent having the most trouble probably here placing how to describe it but i would say there's some fruity notes almost like a fruit salad almost be like fruit stripe gum except less of that cloying sweetness it's a very mild pleasant sweetness and i'm really liking it a lot so let's check out our next Ooh, this is so good i am interrupting myself just to continue playing with this um i'm gonna stop we're gonna ball it up and we'll put it back in the jar but before we move on to the next sense, guess what? We're gonna mist, we're gonna do the mist. So let's put this back in. Once again, I like kind of fold it in there. So this is what I was telling you, I do it at my desk. If I'm in a Zoom, I may not even pull this out of the jar. I just do this, you know? And I'm getting that scent wafting towards my face. You'll notice too, sometimes a little, Residual scent stays on your hands, which I don't know, something about it I, I like because I continue to enjoy the aromatherapy after I'm no longer playing with the dough. So we're done with relief there, but let's give it a spritz. Okay, so it does have a cap like this. I don't know. Let's see if I can do this on camera. So I was a little, I was a little bit close that time probably supposed to do that a little um, farther away. Oh, it's such a light, mild scent. I just want you to know. Um, sometimes products like this, I might've been nervous because 
again, I'm sensitive to scents and if they are too strong or overbearing, um, it might not have the calming effect on me. I might feel almost like stressed out by the amount of scent, like a very heavy scent on my skin. I, I sometimes can feel like it's too much. This is so light and feels absolutely, it feels like water on my skin. I do not feel anything that is um, oily or any other weird texture. It felt like water. And uh, the scent is so light. I think this is super pleasant. I'm gonna try it on my face later. Um, another suggestion is you can refrigerate it. So if you wanna have a cool misting on your face or body, you can do that. This comes in a lot of, I don't know if it was every single one that um, of the scents that the dough comes in, but uh, there was tons of them that pair with the dough. I think there probably is one per, per scent. Um, so this is awesome. I really like this. I could see this being even convenient in my purse to just give myself a mist in the summertime. Uh, kind of that refreshing, cooling feeling to give your face a mist. So that's awesome. And I love the idea of the pairing because you can kind of de-stress with the pinching, but if you were on the go and wanted to give yourself a little spritz to enjoy that aromatherapy benefit, it would be super convenient to do. Hey, let's take a look at Surf. So I'm super happy that Nancy sent us surf. And one of the reasons is because I bet you were wondering, I was wondering as I was trying to make the very difficult decision of what scent to get, how are surf and ocean different? Like what is, what's the difference between these? Because you could imagine in your mind, maybe they have similar scent profiles because they're kind of both inspired by uh, the beach. But let's check this out. First of all, just so you can see, I'm gonna, Pull this one in. Um, this is more of a blue green um, ocean, and this one's more of like a, I would say like a powder blue versus the kind of turquoise or blue green color. And oh my gosh, I'm already getting some of this scent. Uh, oh my gosh, it smells so good. Oh my goodness. Oh, here's the part where I, I, I love to do it and I hate to do it. Mess up the pinch me, let's go. We're all together today, so. This is giving me some of the tropical fruitness. I, I still get that kind of beach feeling that I get from the, the ocean. But remember I said I didn't get the feeling of their sunscreen smell. This doesn't have that either. So just throwing that out there. Um, this smells like I'm getting some coconut, I'm getting some pineapple, like a tropical drink almost, in addition to some of that ocean-like air smell, like fresh air. Um, I definitely am picking up on some coconut and other tropical smells, kind of fruity tropical scents that I really like this one. I really do. Wow. Leave it to Nancy to pick probably my favorite one. Um, <laughs> when I picked for myself, this is so good. I love surf. Just two minutes playing with it, not even. And this is really just awesome. I can't believe how much I love this smell. Mmm. I want to just tell you, I think I mentioned it in the last video, but it bears repeating if you're just tuning in with me for the first time. I'm very close, my face is very close to this dough. I really do think that if you were playing with this in your office environment or in a school environment where you were maybe sitting near other folks, I, I do not think this smell would waft over to them. Like, I think I'm enjoying the aromatherapy benefits here because this is so close to me. But if I was in a cubicle, let's say, and somebody was like two cubicles away, they're not getting like a smell wafting over to them. So I do think this is like a very personalized aromatherapy experience. I love how smooth this is and I absolutely love the scent might be my favorite so far of this of this haul again this is surf it's 
So let's make a ball and let's put it back in. We have one more to see today. See how I do this again? Fold it right in there. Even that's fun to do. Oh, that smells so good. So good. We have one more to look at. And this is Bumbleberry. I believe this is a, one of the newest scents. Um, I think I picked up Grapefruit as one of the new scents. And this is another one that came out recently. Um, I love the color. Look how beautiful that is. I'm a person, I, this is like my favorite color. I love purple. And look at the pinch me. Oh, I have a crumb from the other one. Let me move it away. Um, this is that beautiful stamp. Love it. I smell very faint berry-like scent. So let me get in here. Let's do it. Oh, that texture is awesome, scrumptious, delicious. Love that. Oh, this is a very juicy scent. Let me tell you right now, this is going to be, it's like a multi berries. I'm getting multiple berries here. I'm struggling, but it's mostly my nails. Here we go. This is a gorgeous color. Absolutely love it. I'm just pinching a piece to smell. Oh, I'm getting blackberries. I'm getting raspberries. I am getting blueberries. Um, this is like when you have a mixed berry scented, um, smoothie or something. It really reminds me very smoothie. Like maybe it's part, part of that is from the colors, but I am really picking up on almost like blackberry, raspberry, I would say are the strong, the strongest ones are blueberry too though. Even strawberries could be in there. This is delicious. Don't eat it, it's not for eating, but it sure does smell like it could be delicious. <laughs> Let's look. That texture is awesome as usual. You guys can come to expect a really smooth, silky texture here not like no nothing grainy about this dough it is smooth as ever like a cloud here um i love it i love it i have to say this is a really good smell too it's funny when you pick something for yourself and i asked um i asked nancy i said so surprise me and she sure did because these are like awesome scents and I don't know. It's it's so hard to choose a scented thing from the internet, isn't it? Sometimes have you ever had to make that choice? Like whether you're buying a candle or something like that, a fragrance, it's the type of thing that I, if I can be in store to smell everything, I will. Um, but if I have to choose online, it's so hard just to even describe some of these smells, but this is absolutely a beautiful color. I love it. It just, I would say, this is, I'm like, this is juicy. This is juicy. It reminds me of juice um, or having a smoothie. And I find this a really appealing scent. A very, I would say kind of in, in the vein of the grapefruit, this one might give you a more of an energizing feeling if that's what you wanted. Kind of, because um, it has sort of a bright, happy uh, scent. Some of these might make you kind of in a calm dream-like mode, but this one gives me a little energy feeling and I absolutely love it. Absolutely love it. So I am going to put this back in the jar. I have to say the scent that really took me by surprise and kind of may have rocket launched to the top is, is the surf did not know. I did not know how good that was going to be, but these are, I mean, I can't say a bad thing. I'm going to just show you all of our products one more time. Um, wishing you well. Here is the big one. And we of course have this spray here. So let's just squeeze that in there. So I want to thank you guys so much for joining me today to see my unboxing of Pinch Me products. And uh, thank you so much and please be sure to check the link down below and take a look at all the products they have. They have been 
uh, so enjoyable to me and I hope you find the same thing. So I want to wish everybody a super day and thank you so much for watching. Bye.